Hello guys, welcome back to today's video. I'm sorry if there's noise in the background. I have my dishwasher running right now. Today we are filming Budget Beauty Buys and if you guys have never seen these videos before, what I do is I take you guys shopping with me to TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Burlington, Nordstrom Rack, all the discount stores and we look for high-end makeup at super discounted prices. It is so much fun and I film these videos every single week so make sure you subscribe and tap the notification bell so you don't miss out on these uploads. I've been finding tons of awesome new makeup recently and I am so excited to see what we're going to find this week. I feel like um, there's definitely been a lot of new stuff and I am like waiting for that super awesome item that's gonna show up in 2021 at TJ Maxx and Marshall that's just gonna like blow us away. I feel like we haven't seen an eyeshadow palette in a while, like a, I don't wanna say famous, but like I guess a well-known eyeshadow palette. So I'm like waiting for what's gonna be the next item that's gonna be like the big thing we're all gonna freak out over. If you guys want to come shopping with me, then let's go do it. I'm gonna hit up a bunch of different stores today in my area. TJ Maxx, Marshall. I already did go to Burlington, so you guys will see that. I found a lot of good stuff. And without further ado, let's get on into Budge Beauty Buys. I found in the clearance section this All May makeup wipes. These were only 50 cents. I thought that was a great deal. I also found the First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Cream for only one dollar. I don't know if it was tampered with, but just wanted to share that. Pink Sugar Body Lotion. This was an awesome find and it was only three dollars. Yellow tag clearance. I love Pink Sugar. I've always been a fan. This Claws Hand Cream was only 70 cents. I've never heard of this brand, but I thought it was a great deal. Okay, next door, I went to Burlington and I wanted to show you they had the cutest headbands. I loved this style because it was like a nice new take on that pearl headband. You guys know how much I love star print. So this is super cute with the gold stars. And then this one with the rainbowy rhinestones, I just thought was really unique and pretty. These were $4.99. And this leather poofy one I thought was really cute too. Okay, some makeup and skincare. I found this Pacifica Mineral Crystal Shimmer Lip Balm. This is vegan and cruelty free. This was $2.99. Pacifica is one of my favorite skincare brands. This is a set from Nug. This is another great brand. This is their Lip Duo Scrub for $2.99. They come in those cute little egg-shaped um, tins. <laughs> More Makeup Revolution products. This is the Glow Revolution Shimmer Spray, which I think is a dupe for the iconic london shimmer spray which i also have so that was really cool this was a great find the mac pigment set you get four pigments in here glitters and shimmer shades i had never seen this before and to think it was at burlington was so cool so this was 9.99 and you can see the original price at 15 so i'm just showing you guys what the inside looks like this was previously opened by someone else so i just took it out to show you another mac find at burlington this is the hyper real glow highlighter palette for $14.99 and then I found this L'Oreal Voluminous Emerald Green Mascara which I thought was a really pretty shade this was $3.99 typically these are like $10 this was a fun vine Milani hot cool and vicious collab they did with salt and pepper and this was $6.99 and this was a fun palette so here's what the inside looks like it was covered in plastic and you even got a highlighter in the middle so I thought this was so cool I love finding collab palettes Ilor and Nikki Philippi lashes this was another collab Milani the violet one mascara this was actually a duo pack for $5.99 this Lip Trio, do you guys remember this brand? This was like one of the first liquid lipsticks that got popular and it has the little glitter. An Eyelore Brow Palette, this was $2.99. Revlon Photo Ready Airbrush Primer, I have this. This is so good, they did discontinue it, but if you can find it at Burlington, it is only $3.99 and that was a great find. I also found the Revolution Conceal and Hydrate Foundation. And a Bobbi Brown, this is a stick foundation, and this was $12.99. I've never seen Bobbi Brown there before. Okay, moving on to TJ Maxx, I found this again. I found it last week as well, this mini NARS eyeshadow palette for $9.99. Super cute. And then I also found the MAC Frost Lipstick in the shade Fabby, which 
I had never heard of this color before and I feel like I know a lot of the MAC shades but it's like a really pretty kind of frosted gold pink. Moving on to Kat Von D. This is the lash liner. This was an inner lash liner which I had never seen before so I thought it was an interesting product. This was $4.99. I found this volume powder by IGK called 30,000 feet. That was $9.99. Moving on to my next store, I found more of the Becca Pearl Lippies. I found an Eco Tools blending sponge. This one was a pretty mint color. It didn't have a price, but probably like $2.99. Cover Effects Custom Cover Drops. And these were $6.99. They had tons of these Kiko Milano little palettes. I found so many of these at like every store. Cover FX High Performance Setting Spray. There was a lot of cover effects this, at this particular store and the sprays were super cheap. This is the Crystal Infused Elixir Mist with Aquamarine. And this one was only $5.99. Cover FX Gripping Primer. This was $9.99. I'm finding more of the Bare Minerals Bounce and Blur Blushes. This one is Blurred Buff. I actually own this one. I bought it when it was like full price. $8.99. This one is really, really pretty. These have like a soft, squishy texture to them. And I also found Pink Sky and Mauve Sunrise. You guys have seen me find these in the past, so just sharing them again. I found this again. I found it last week as well, the Becca Dreamsicle Highlighter. This is, it's hiding there, but it's $9.99. This is a really pretty, like, orangey shade. Becca uh, Refresh Powder in Golden Bronze for $9.99. This is a new find. This is a K-Beauty brand. I previously had seen this at CVS. This is their Peach Blur Face Primer for $3.99. And I actually own this one, the Banana Milk Blur Primer. So I thought that was really fun. Moving on to Marshalls, I found the Becca and Jaclyn Hill collab. This is the Shimmery Skin Perfector Slim Light in Champagne Pop for only $5.99. So it's like a little pen. You can kind of see the swatch there all the way on the right. And this is like literally the collab packaging with Jaclyn's picture on it. So I thought that was really funny. And then this is what the product looks like. Pretty cool find. NARS Orgasm Blush. This was like out of the packaging, but I liked the the rose gold look to it and they also had this little duo set where you got a mini blush and a lipstick for $14.99 they had a lot of these kiss impress on pressed nails for $3.99 like tons of different styles this is the super goop setting powder with SPF 45 and this is $9.99 and this Buxom set, this is in VIP only. This is from the their most recent holiday collection. This is $9.99. The shades are Sandy and Claire. All right, guys. So that is it for this week's episode of Budget Beauty Buys. It's so crazy. I just went to a Marshalls and literally there was nothing there to show you guys. Like everything was just kind of same old no new restock so that was kind of unfortunate um so this week's episode is probably going to be a little bit shorter than usual but i hope you guys still enjoyed seeing everything that i found and there was still some new stuff so that was exciting and let me know in the comments down below what did you guys find this week i absolutely love hearing from you i'll show you a little haul that i did i got a couple things um more like home food things i'm like trying to prioritize health and um good foods and things like that and supplements so i've been really into that section at tj maxx and marshall's so i'll show you what i got let me move my masks out of the way so you guys can see oh so i picked up some oop, got this from dollar tree super cute pearl headband i picked up some pitted dates if you guys have never tried dates before you must try them they are so good they're 100 percent natural they have their own natural sugar so like by themselves they have like a decent amount of sugar in them, 25 grams per four to five, 
but it's natural sugar so I don't mind this is a wonderful dessert what you do is you cut it open and you put peanut butter in the middle oh my gosh you guys it tastes like nature's Reese's peanut butters it's so good you can also grind them up in like a food processor and use them in different like healthy desserts that still taste really good because of the natural sugars that are in here so these were $4.99 this and the brand is called Royal Palm I love like all the little snacks and stuff that they have okay this next one I picked up this was a little more pricey this is from the OMG line you're probably seeing these also at TJ Maxx recently so this has cacao powder ashwagandha which is a mushroom which is great for like your brain um lion's mane's mushrooms and rhodiola so this is a superfood it's 20 calories per one tablespoon and basically this is like a healthy kind of hot chocolate that's good for your body for your brain um and i've been reading a lot about the different types of mushrooms this is like really coming up right now um no pun intended mushrooms um but you can put it in beverages as like a hot chocolate you can add it to your coffee you can put it in your smoothies you can put it in your yogurt like as a topping this was 9.99 so i don't mind paying a little bit more for things like this because it's organic it's good for your body your brain it helps you focus and it's natural which is amazing it's like things that are just from the earth god's creations so i think this is so cool i love this stuff also at home i got beetroot powder which is also amazing like a natural fun pink color so i picked that up as well i also got a milk frother which i have to show you guys it's amazing and it was $3.99. I'll put a picture of it here because I posted about it on my Dollar Tree Instagram. So yeah, I'm super excited about this because I was buying those little packets of the, what's that brand at Whole Foods? It's like the little packets of the mushroom hot chocolate. And those are $1.99 and they're one time use. So I figured with this, I can just scoop from the container and I have a better supply so I don't have to keep buying those little packets and this is literally the same thing and cacao powder is like the raw chocolate like from the earth so it's a little bit more bitter but it's really good for you. also switching out my pans my pans and stuff are from when I got married in 2014 2013 and I feel like that was like a dicey time for cookware and stuff so this is the green pan it's a healthy ceramic non-stick free of PFAs PFOA lead and cadmium I've heard really good things about green pan and I just started seeing it pop up. So I'm investing in getting new pans. This one is just like a little one. You can all, they also give you the little top. This was $12.99 and my other ones are just, they're old and I don't know, I don't trust it anymore. So I'm replacing my pan, but surely, and then it's gonna be hard to show you guys, but I also got this Big Mama Jama, which is a casserole. I'm gonna use it for pasta, which I guess is kind of the same thing, but this one was more, I think this was, yeah, this was $24.99. So I splurged and got it because like I said, I wanted to get something that was good, that was known to be good and wasn't like, was toxin free, like truly toxin free. So that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this week's episode. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed my little haul. Question of the day is what is your favorite health food that you've ever gotten from TJ Maxx or Marshall's? Like any sort of little snack there? Their snack section is so, so good. Let me know in the comments down below. I have these little like Reese's peanut butter cup type things there that are made of almond butter that I love um, I get honey from there that is so good I'm almost out of that I got that on clearance yeah so let me know in the comments I love you guys so much and I will see you in my next episode bye